हेलो वेलकम डियर हेलो वेलकम डियर स्टूडेंट वी हैव अ क्वेश्चन ओवर हियर सो द क्वेश्चन इज चार्ज पार्टिकल ऑलवेज मूव इन द डायरेक्शन ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड इज दिस स्टेटमेंट ट्रू और फॉल्स सो लेट्स सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन नाउ सो लेट्स अज्यूम दैट इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड इज इन द प्लस एक्स डायरेक्शन और प्लस आई कैप करेक्ट सो आई एम कॉलिंग ई वैक्टर टू बी ई ऑफ आई कैप करेक्ट That's what I'm assuming. And uh, suppose we have a charge particle, and uh, we have a charge particle plus charge particle. So that means a force is acting. Why force is acting on this charge particle? Because of this electric field. So if this is a charge particle and this is the direction, the electric field is in this direction, and this is a positively charged particle. What this electric field does to this charge particle? It exerts a force on this charge particle and the value of force is in the direction of electric field and it is equal to charge multiplied by electric field this amount of force is acting because of the electric field and this force drives this charge particle along the direction of electric field correct but if i take a negatively charged particle <coughs> here so what it does to this charge particle because electric field is in this direction now force is acting on in this direction now because this is a negatively charged particle that means charged particle starts moving opposite to the direction of electric field and the force is acting in the same magnitude wise charge multiplied by the electric field okay <clears throat> so from here we can conclude that we have to look at the nature of charge if that is positive so it will go along the direction of electric field if it is a negative discharge particle it will go opposite to the direction of electric field so the statement is our charged particle always move so that is a wrong statement a charged particle <coughs> a charged particle always move in the direction in the direction of electric field so this statement is wrong false okay why this is false this is false because of this always if they say a charged particle may move in the direction of electric field that's good that's okay that's the correct statement but this is not because they have said always so that's wrong hope this answer your question thank you very much hope guys that you like this solution and uh, please make sure to subscribe the channel thank you very much.